Today, JP and I are doing an excursion to the artisan villages right outside Cuenca. We are going to visit three artisan villages this morning that are about an hour drive. We're really excited because we haven't seen any of the uh, cantons yet, and each canton is it's known for a special trade. So we're going to see guitar making, jewelry making, uh, textiles, all in today's trip. This is going to be a three-part video because we have a lot to cover today. Our second stop is Chortaleg. Chortaleg is known for its silver and gold filigree jewelry, so I'm really excited to go and see. And we're off. Como se llama? Hello, my name is Wilson. I'm gonna be your driver guy for today. Hola, Wilson. Hi. Mucho gusto. Mucho gusto para mí. Un gusto es mío. Okay, so today we will visit, you know, uh, three different towns. Mm -hmm. uh, the first town is gonna be in 45, 50 minutes, you know. Okay. The name of the lovely town is San Bartolomé. Okay. It's a very charming town. We're going to, to visit the guitars workshop. After that, we're going to Chor de Lake to see the ceramic, the miniature ceramic. Mm -hmm. We give you time in the park so you can visit the jewelry shop stores, right. you know. Mm -hmm. And in the end, we're going to Wallaceo. Right. Wallaceo, the textiles, if you like visit the orchids. Nice. Okay, so that's the itinerary for today, right? So after that, we return it to the city. That sounds great. Anything where you need, please let me know, right? Okay. Welcome to the tour. Thank you. Great, thank you. You're and welcome. we're off. <laughs> <laughs> the Cañari Cemetery oh. and the tradition for Cañaris when somebody important died pass away they always bury with the best vestiment okay. with the best accessories we're right. talking about crowns oh. chains wow. knuckles you know bracelets earrings in gold, gold and silver, silver copper wow. you know different materials so that's why this town is very famous about the minerals, you know, the, the metals. Chordele was the Cañari Cemetery. Wow, and Chordele means gold? A little bit of gold. Little bit of gold. Little bit of gold, Chordele. This guy, it's called Fernando Loja. This guy make miniature ceramic. Mm -hmm. Miniature ceramic. Miniature ceramic. So he learned it, you know, from the old guy from Chordele, his name is Salvador Lopez. This guy worked already in this job more of 26 years, you know. And that's the only only guy in, in this area what still work with ceramic and miniature. Oh wow. De qué país viene? Uh, Estados Unidos. Ah, de Estados Unidos. Sí. Ah, si le gusta Cuenca. Oh. Pequeña ciudad. Pequeño. 500.000 habitantes. Yeah. 500 mil personas. Mm -hmm. Sí. Ah, tiene yeah. cuenca. Uh, yeah. Poca, yeah. poca gente, no es grande como Nueva York. Sí, millones. no, no, yeah. Yeah. Millones, no mucho. Like, uh, sí, Quito es muy grande. Sí, también más, sí, Quito. The clay is fascinating. Mm -hmm. They have to go by horse to, to get it, to get it yeah. three hours from here. I just can't, I, I can't, can't believe how gorgeous these are so... And they use water, you know, to, yeah. to move it, they clean it too. He makes it look very easy. Oh, yeah. For 26 years. Yeah. <laughs> he cut the, the wood to make it the fire. This lady selling in the market. You see, a couple of lovers opposite of the agave plants. Oh, this is a very nice... This guy represents an illustrious, I mean, a special character. Mm -hmm. When we celebrate Christmas, in Cuenca, or in Ecuador, this guy represents Mayoral. Mayoral is a, a farm, he's an owner farm. And of course, this guy has a lot of money. So he decorated the horse, you see, with fruits, yeah. Oh, with, yeah. with the snacks, with candies, with different things. And the end of the procession, he shared okay. to the children, to the poor people, you know. Mm -hmm. You see the angels, 
This guy here is called Kuri King. This guy is one of the characters what opened the, the parades. Okay. He's a dancer. You know, Kuri King is uh, the Andean bird. Right. Cara Cara Carantulet represents this guy. She takes out the liquid what holds between the steam and the, and the roots, you know. Usually in Mexico they use they destillate it and became in tequila. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And yeah. here it's called Mishki. The indigenous use like a walk and drink. When oh, you can visit okay. them, they offer this the Mishki. Does it taste like tequila? No, it's sweet. Oh, it's sweet. Usually is 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 the, the liquid what they use to become in tequila when you destillate. Yeah. In example in here they represent a special dancers. Mm -hmm. It's called Tucuman. Tucuman, the dancer dance around of the stick and they try to form like a, like a brain, you know? Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. It's a nice, nice and traditional. You see, in here they sell in different products in the market. Look this guy. He sells lentil, the oh, corn, yeah. the beans. You see? That's our favorite one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the other guy, he, he's weaving the hats oh, yeah. with a straw, you see? Remember, all the, the wow. straw, the, 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 the hats came from this right. region as well. Um, right here. You see, this lady make the 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 the, the reeds. Right. They, they spin the wool. You yeah. Know? This this guy baskets. here selling basket. That's for the nativity. Mm -hmm. You see the Joseph, the Mary. Here is one of the. This is the, the Fernando's daughter. You oh. know? Okay. And she works as well in here. You know. Oh. It's a family business. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it's good because they continue. You know. Yeah. One generation. This is so impressive. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, they the use the, 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 the wood chips, you know, to oh, burn. Oh, okay. And they make the, the, the yeah, they, oh, they make the, 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 the black label, you know. Wow. So it's burned. So it's like burned. burned. Yeah, burned. and, and never is gonna. Example, if you watch this, don't go out the color, you know. They, they right. maintain the, the color. Oh, yeah, because it's all throughout. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. There's like leaves, there's patterns yeah. in these bowls. Mm -hmm. See, look at this one. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah. Oh, wow, I know. Crazy. Wow. People are, people's talent is so amazing to me. The job what the two brothers use is called filigree. Right. Filigree. Mm -hmm. So they use, I told you, 18,000 grains of silver. Wow. And they need like a three months to finish. A big this is for the lady of 27 meters. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. that even can cost uh, $100,000. Wow. It's called a chong, chongon, chongonda? No, Kandonga. 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 You have the name over there. Kandonga. Yeah. 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 This is cool because you can really see... The biggest earring in the it's world. Like a, they're like braids almost. Wow, that's gorgeous. Amelia's in hog heaven. <laughs> We found jewelry. But it's almost overwhelming. There's I know. Like store after store after store. There's more than 70 jewelry stores in this little Pueblo, little village here in the mountains. The Indian mountains. There's just beautiful jewelry. It's almost too much for the eyes to take in. I think these are beautiful. And then, then right behind here, it's sculpture. It's gorgeous. And the filigree is really amazing. Yeah, the filigree is amazing. How they use the little wire. The wires to, to make these things, silver wire. This is a picture of Amelia in analysis paralysis. Because <laughs> it's too much. There's so many things and so many stores that she's just, her brain is shut down at this point. She just is looking at things indiscriminately. <laughs> shut up. <laughs> We're checking out the, the square. It's gorgeous. El Centro. It's a beautiful square. It is. And the sun just came out. It's been cloudy all morning, but now the sun is out. It's warming up. It's beautiful. There's the church in the town square. And we just saw some dogs, stray dogs, running in and out of the church. Hi, veggie lovers. We are back from Chortleg. Chortleg is known for its silver and gold filigree jewelry and also for its ceramic miniatures. So our first stop in the Chortleg, which is a really cute little town, by the way. It's actually quite a bit larger than San Bartolome. I think 15,000 people live in Chortleg. Anyway, our first stop was to the ceramics miniature workshop and store, which was a really fun experience to see how they make these teeny tiny little miniatures. Um, 
It's not really our thing, but we did appreciate the craftsmanship that goes into that and the fact that it had been passed down, the skill has been passed down through their family from generation to generation. And it's also very popular, those little ceramic miniatures uh, for the holidays. So they do a lot of nativity scenes and things like that. So who knows, maybe you'll see one. And you did buy a neat little plate for I the did, jewelry. I did, I bought, they also do some pottery. Uh, so I bought a piece of pottery for my jewelry, which I really like. <laughs> then we went into the center of the town, so the square, which is absolutely gorgeous. However, it felt a little touristy because it was surrounded by jewelry store after jewelry store after jewelry store. 70. It was overwhelming. <laughs> I was all excited to go jewelry shopping and I didn't buy anything because it was information overload. I could not deal. Amelia had analysis paralysis. I did. She, <laughs> there was so much to look at and choose from that she couldn't make a decision. Well, and it was crowded too. So I think if I want to go back and try again, we'll go when it's not so crowded. But we did see the world's largest earring. Yes, that was cool. We went into the little museum and saw the pottery and the world's largest earring, um, which is gorgeous. And it was actually, seeing the world's largest earring was really cool because you can truly see the craftsmanship of the filigree up close. Mm -hmm. So I really enjoyed it. Please remember to like, comment, and share on our YouTube channel. And make sure you check out our video on San Bartolome and on Gualaseo. It's a TARDIS purse. It's bigger on the inside. <laughs> That is true.